Hey everyone, welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be opening up here the Shining Fates Elite Trainer Box. Yes, this is the second one I actually have. I'm definitely very happy about this, very pleased about this because there will be 10 packs to open up. Definitely just very excited. I'm just going to open it up right away because we've already gone over uh, this particular box last time. So this will be very fun to see what we can actually get out of this, but let's just see what we actually have inside. So this is everything opened up here. We have our 10 packs, definitely fantastic. We already took a look at all of the other contents in the previous ETB openings, so there's no need to actually go over it again. However, just seeing here the uh, nice promo card is definitely just, well, it's just a really great thing to get. So yeah, I'm quite pleased about this. This would be my second copy. But of course, you guys could actually just have the ETB code. Uh, have fun with that, you know, it's just really nice for you guys, but uh, with that being said we have our 10 packs here We have two Charizard packs. I noticed we have three Corby Knight packs We have over here uh, Two Dragapult packs and then three Toxtricity packs So definitely going to be quite fun to see which ones are actually gonna have any good cards in there But you know what? Let's just get started right away We're gonna open up with the Charizard pack first and hopefully things actually go well now on personal experience, I do actually get quite bad pulls when it comes to the Charizard packs, but you know what, this video might actually change it all. This particular opening might uh, be a lot more different, so here's the code for you guys. Enjoy. We'll take the top four cards, move it to the bottom. Let's find out what we get. So a bit of repetitive cards here, uh, that's no surprise whatsoever, but maybe we'll get a different shiny here. We have a Reverse Hollow Snom, that's not bad at all, but we have a Galarian Weezing. Alright, it is a Hollow, which is nice, but uh, not a particularly significant card in any kind of way, so we're just going to move on. Though, getting a Galarian Weezing for the first time is definitely fantastic. Let's go with the Corby Knight pack and see how we actually do in this pack. Alright. Now, Corby Knights actually give quite interesting pulls. Sometimes I get good, sometimes I get bad. But I guess we'll find out with this particular pack over here. Alright, so we have Green Energy, Eldegrass, Cremorant, a very fantastic card. We have your Ball Guy, Morpeko, Blizzle, we have Nickit, Cacnea, we have Kufant, a Reverse Hollow Cacnea, nice, not too bad at all, and. Just a regular rare Celebi. Alright, so, so far two packs in and we are not doing well whatsoever. Now, of course, mind you, this is an ETB, so don't expect too many good pulls out of this because uh, according to a lot of other people's experiences as well, it's not particularly the product you want to get to actually get the best pulls. This is mostly just to get a bunch of packs, have a bit of fun opening them, so we'll find out what we actually get out of all of these packs here. Oh, another Cremorant, I just consider that a win. So let's see, what else can we get here? Can we even get any shinies at all? That would be fantastic. We have, speaking of a shiny, we have here our first one, we have Galarian Farfetch'd. Absolutely stunning, love the texture, love the feel of it. And uh, first time pulling a Galarian Shiny Farfetch'd, I'm quite happy indeed. So we'll set that aside and, oh fantastic, we have here a Full Art Ball Guy as well. I have no complaints about this, just a really nice card, definitely an interesting card for what it is, but uh, yeah, quite fantastic to actually pull this, so I have no complaints whatsoever. 
that's definitely a wonderful pack because that's considered a double pull. So with that being said, we're three packs in, we got something really good on the third pack. Let's move on here to our Dragapult pack and see how we go. Alright, so we're going to pry this open. Let's see how we go here. Alright, so we take the top four cards, move it to the bottom. Let's see how we go in this one. What do we have? Speaking of which, we got Ball Guy again. Fantastic. Let's see. Trapping, Shinx, Rowlet. We have Eevee. We have a Reverse Hollow Trapinch, not bad, and just a regular Rare Mana Fee. Alright, that was kind of expected anyway, it's not like I'm expecting much uh, from that, but we have 6 packs left, let's go back to, let's go for Corby Knight since we have 2 of them, so let's see what we actually get in this one. Alright, hopefully we get a bit lucky on it, but... You know, we never know what we actually get out of the ETB packs. So we have four cards. Let's move it to the bottom. We have here Psychic Energy, Rusted Sword, Dartrix, Yanma, Snom, nice. We have Q Fans. We have Grookey. We have Boozle. Do we get another shiny? No, we have here a Reverse Hollow Elder Gross. Not bad. And a professor's research regular rare all right so nothing there quite unfortunate but that's okay we have five packs left we can still definitely do something and uh, get something well out of it so here's a toxicity pack let's find out what we actually get in this pack now let's pry open the pack let's give you guys the code and we'll take the top four move it to the bottom let's see how we actually go in this one Ball Guy, we have Snom, we have Q Fans, we have Grookey, we have Bizzle, we have Yanma, a Reverse Holo Gossifla, alright, and a regular rare Celebi. Wow, we are definitely quite unfortunate in all of our pulls so far. We only got one good pack really, so we have four packs left. I'm just gonna go with the Charizard pack right away uh, because I don't expect too much out of the Charizard pack. So, if we do poorly on it, it's something that I was kind of expecting anyway. If we get something good, then it would actually be quite a surprise. But let's just find out. We have here Cremorant. I'm very happy about that. We have here Thwacky, Trapping, Shinx, Rowlet. We have Eevee, Morpeko, a Reverse Hollow Q Fant. All right, and. Oh, unfortunate, but we have a regular hollow Rillaboom. Not bad, because it's the first time I'm pulling it, but still not particularly anything significant here. So, definitely quite unfortunate, but we have three packs left. Let's see how we actually go here. I'm going to go back to the Corby Knight pack and we'll see how we actually go. Alright, so I've got to pry this open. And we can pull out the cards here. Here's the code for you guys, enjoy. We take the top four cards, move it to the bottom. Let's see how we actually go in this one here. We have Team Yotao, we have Luxio, Nickit, Eevee, we have Gossifla, we have Choodle, we have Morpeko, and Indeedee, but this one's a reverse holo. I've got multiples of the uh, regular holos, but first time I'm getting a reverse holo, so nice, and a regular rare dreadnought unfortunate wow we are eight packs in and we've only got one pack that actually had anything at all so definitely quite unfortunate our luck is not doing well i'm going to open up the toxicity pack save the dragapult pack for last but there's one way to actually make it up and that would be to actually pull good out of both of these so Hopefully that's the case, but I guess we just have to find out. Here's the code card. We'll take the top four cards, move it to the bottom. Let's see how we go in this one. Dark Energy. We have Ball Guy, Tropius. We have here, oh, another Cremorant. Nice. We have Spinarak. We have Buizel. We have Rowlets. We have Trapinch. We have Snom. A Reverse Hollow Buizel. And... A regular res are rude. Wow, we are doing really poorly on this here. I mean, final pack, 
hopefully things go well, but let's just find out. I mean, the luck has definitely been quite awful with this, so I'm hoping things go well here, but I'm definitely starting to get disappointed out of this, so let's just find out how our final pack actually goes. I mean, if we get Zard, we make up for it. We get another Cramorant, so that's nice, but can we actually get anything to make it up? I don't know, let's find out. Okay, a shiny Dreepy. I mean, better late than never, but I guess it's a nice card to actually pull. Again, love the texture, fantastic, and a regular rare mana fee. Alright, so let's do a really quick recap here because there's really just not much to it. We have our shiny Dreepy, we have over here our full art ball guy, and we have over here our shiny Galarian Farfetch'd. So we are definitely <laughs> pretty unlucky with this, to be honest, because, I mean, we opened up 10 packs here. So to see that we only got all of these, it's definitely very unfortunate. It makes me feel like I should have just kept my uh, ETB sealed up uh, just for a sealed collection. But unfortunately, with what we got here, I don't really think it was the most amazing of pulls, but... You know, tell me what you guys actually think about this. Uh, if you enjoyed this video, or if you at least feel sorry for these particular pulls, then definitely drop a like, share this video, subscribe, don't forget to hit the bell notification. I hope you all have a wonderful day. I'll see you all next time.